Hey Virgos, hoping that everybody's well. Good morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are in this world. Welcome to the channel if you're new and if you're one of my amazing subscribers, thank you. You guys are incredible. Your support means everything. And if you're not, go ahead and hit the button. Hit subscribe. It's free. And it helps to support the channel. Please note these are general messages. They're not going to resonate for everybody. So just take what does and leave the rest. Um, don't try to make it fit to your situation and don't scare yourself. If, if some of these messages are coming up and you're like, no, I don't think that's what's going on in my situation, then you're right. It's not what's going on for you. So don't, uh, don't freak yourself out, okay? Um, if you'd like a personal reading that's specific to your situation, you can find a link to my website in the description box below. And also, you can check out your Moon, Rising, and Venus sign placements in those videos to see if any of those energies are resonating more for you at this point in time. So starting out, what I see going on is um, you've got this Three of Wands energy. I feel like somebody's trying to stay in a secure place at this point in time. It makes them feel safe. They're, they're not up for tackling something different or they're not up for going on quests of new adventures or they're not somebody who wants to explore the unknown, if you will. They're also not really having foresight in a situation. They might not be looking for other possibilities or planning ahead. They may even be in a position of not knowing what to expect at this point of point in time, or they might not be taking a long view in terms of where something is going in a connection. This person this person might not provide needed direction. Like they don't have um they're not demonstrating leadership qualities when it comes to uh, a connection. Sorry, I'm going to deal with puppy. Sorry about that, Virgos. <laughs> so yeah, so this is not uh, somebody who demonstrates leadership in terms of taking the main role or um, I guess you could say assuming responsibilities in, in whatever capacity they're showing up in and it's almost like I'm getting this feeling of maybe you're wanting them to make a move maybe you're waiting on the person here which is this king of cups which could be cancer Pisces or Scorpio maybe you're hoping that they're going to take the lead here or that they're going to take a leap of faith or that they're going to make an effort right but this is the type of person who is quite calm. They usually maintain their composure. They've got a quieting influence on others. Um, this is somebody who doesn't seem very nervous or tense. They're quite diplomatic and caring and very tolerant, but also accepts the limitations of others and allows others their freedom. So I'm getting a sense like if you're if you're waiting on somebody who you want to make a move or to take action, I don't know if this person is that that type of person. I feel that because they're caring, like this is somebody who responds to emotional needs, usually is a natural healer, could even be a therapist, but this is um this is somebody who really it's like they don't want to push the envelope. Do you know what I mean? They they don't want to overstep their boundaries. So I feel like this person has a lot of feelings for you. They care a lot for you. But I don't feel that they're taking um, a leadership role or they're not acting. And that could be a little frustrating if that's what you're expecting. Maybe you're wanting them to take the reins. Yeah, see, look at this. Because you've got the Eight of Wands. And the Eight of Wands speaks to um, haste or speed or taking quick action, 
making a move, right? Like striking while the iron is hot. Uh, this is about declaring oneself openly and putting plans into action. Like basically moving into a higher gear. But again, it's, it's about culminating an effort. So I feel like there's a number of elements at play here. And I feel like you think that this would make you very happy is if they would just make the move, right? And if you've been waiting on news, some of you might be receiving news that's gonna make you very happy. Maybe this is what they're going to do. Maybe they are gonna take some quick action. Maybe they're gonna to come to this conclusion that they do need to culminate an effort. And now they want to take that step forward with you because look at the sun energy here. The sun is the happiest card in the deck and it's also a major arcana. So it's like maybe they've become enlightened if you guys haven't been talking for a little while or um, even if you are together, maybe the points you made, they're starting to understand and they're finding the sense behind any chaos or maybe they're attaining a new level of insight, right? I feel like they're having an intellectual breakthrough and uh, they're starting to realize the truth that they want to experience the greatness of this connection. So I feel like they're going to become radiantly energized. Like, and I feel like you're going to be receiving really good news and you're going to experience so much joy. You're going to feel like just bursting with enthusiasm. You're getting some news here regarding this person. So maybe whether you just got them to see things your way or you finally were able to get them to take action or they finally decided like, look, Virgo is the one who is my sunshine and I'm heading towards my sunshine. I think you're headed for some very, very happy times. I feel like some of you have been waiting patiently and there it was, yeah, because they weren't taking action. But I don't think also that they were looking at the long term. Because like I said, I feel like that person or this person you might be dealing with is somebody who um, isn't forceful like the King of Wands. This is not somebody who's full of energy. I, I feel like they are more of um, an emotional type where they're quite content to be homebodies maybe. Or the they're just very relaxed as opposed to this type of energy which is someone who grabs that wand and takes the lead. So I feel like you may have been waiting patiently and you're just at the point now where you're done waiting for this person to, to cooperate, like you see. But the good news is, is that this energy here, this King of Wands is facing this Three of Pentacles and the Three of Pentacles is about working together to achieve a goal, coming together, getting all the pieces right, um, figuring out how to work as a team, right? So this person might get this insight now, and maybe that's what it is. Maybe they're going to say to you, look, I want this relationship, or I would like to be in a relationship, or I want to move ahead in this connection. Like, let's take it to the next step, you know? I feel like this person wants to nail down the details because it's like now they're going to start planning ahead and they want to function as a unit right like getting the job done together so whatever this is i i feel like they want to combine the efforts towards a common goal and i feel like it's that third pentacle which is um stable connection and if it's not a stable connection then if you're already in a stable connection then it's about reaching some goal that you've been wanting to work on. Maybe it's about having a child. Maybe it's about um, getting a house, purchasing a house together, moving in together. But finally, I feel like this person is willing to take action. Okay? So I think that that is great news, especially because you've got that sun energy. I mean, lucky you. <laughs> so you're going to be receiving um, 
maybe even some help financially or some sort of gifts again there's that three of pentacles wants to come up so i feel like this person i'm even just getting to for some of you that maybe they've made some extra money to put towards a per purchase but i think now you're going to see that you do have the resources because this is about giving and receiving being taken care of being supported um, I feel like they're going to offer you a lot of support. And I feel like they're going to step up and they're going to start leading and dominating like or acting with some authority. They're going to take action. That's what I'm really getting here. They're, they're finally going to take action. So if you've been waiting on something, good news, you're not the beggar anymore. <laughs> So let's see what we got here. When could this start uh, happening? See, the time is right. Told you. It's going to happen very quickly, especially with that eight of wands. So you're going to receive the news, whether that be a discussion, whether you guys actually sit down and, and, and you make this decision now to move forward. I feel like everything, the stars are aligning. <laughs> Because the time is right. So that's absolutely awesome, Virgos. <laughs> if you've been wondering, now you know. So that's what I got for you. I hope you all have an amazing rest of your day. And I will see you again soon. Bye.